Can we get a shut the oh. on He's fired. Oh, I love this place. <laughs> Hello, CHS. I'm Jamie. And I'm Gary, and this is Columbia Cougar News. There will be a Cougar Nation meeting today at 305 and B134. And Stuco candy grams are being sold today and Wednesday during lunch and ninth period. Make sure you bring your cash and know your recipient's ELA teacher and period. There will be an interest meeting today at 3 p.m. in room C229 for the annual Beat Fest being held Friday, April 21st at The Woodland. All bands, rappers, and singer-songwriters are encouraged to attend. Scan the QR code you see on the screen for more info. The cast of CCN felt that we were missing a little bit of flair when it came to some of our segments. So I am proud to introduce our fierce, fabulous, and utterly flamboyant take on Project Runway. All right, welcome everyone. We're doing Project Runway CCN. We've got two teams and they're going to compete, making outfits for their models using only paper and tape. Let's meet our teams. Your team name. The team. This is the team. All right, how you feeling? Here we have... Sorry. And this is our second team. What do you yeah, guys call we, yourself? I, I, I would just like to state for the record that right before the camera started rolling, Brayden said that women cannot succeed in creative fields. I agree. <laughs> what? <laughs> I was trying to help her, so she so I asked if she was helping her co-design. It's exactly right. Steal that paper! Steal that paper! No, steal that paper! Three! The two, one! Three! Two! One! So, what are your design ideas? I can't tell you. Guys, you have to do it on the I'm the camera person. I can't tell you all here, man. They won't, they won't, they won't. It's in... We're gonna do something really awesome. <laughs> Ew! What are your design ideas? Um, so the first thing that we need to do is cover his face. <laughs> but we need to ensure that the mustache is still visible, so... <laughs> oh my god, that's perfect. I'm sorry. We're not like Les Yaga. We are Elf Love. Okay. Oh, it doesn't fit. Guys, should we draw on this six pack or should we rip it into six little pieces and tape them on? Put the El Quo logo on my torso. Okay. So, are, are you gonna like have pants or like a skirt or something? No, we're gonna oh. draw pentagrams all over me. <laughs> what? Urban corset. Oh, yeah, I am God. That goes so I am God. Hard. What's your thoughts? Okay. Um, I would have, if it was me, I would have taken it in a How really different direction. But, um, I respect so their creative spirit. Oh, we Where do it like that. Oh, yeah. Extra points if you can explain your piece. I love CCA. Yeah. Loving the layering. That's, I'm really liking the shirt. It's so put together. It's like a one shoulder moment. You see that? Oh, I love it. And you, oh. Thank you. Stop, stop. Beauty is pain. All right, we finished the designing. Now we're moving on to the runway walk. The first walk is going to be Alex James, modeling for Team Team. You went on I think that we were robbed. We have a member of Sexy University here. We see his six pack. <laughs> Elko, how do you feel? Our win was very deserved. We went with all the great trends, and I think that was really noticed by the judges, which we appreciated. Um, yeah, Elko. Never, never, never stop. Never stop. Never stop. Elko. Never stop. Never stop. We're the future. You went away. The deadline for registering in complete completing your spring athletic physical information is February 13th. All forms must be brought to Vanessa in room C128. For questions regarding specific sports, please reach out to the coach. And remember, practices and games do take place over spring break. Seniors, don't forget to join the class of 23 Snapperies and help fundraise for our senior prom. Go to the senior class Instagram page, create an account, and follow the instructions to start raising money. Our merch sale is also live, so you can buy some class of 23 Merch. And the Senior Class Student Council is running a Krispy Kreme fundraiser. You can support our class by purchasing a voucher for donuts. The order link is on their Instagram at Columbia Class of 23. Vouchers will be emailed to you within two to three business days after purchase and can be redeemed at any Krispy Kreme. All through the month of February, in honor of Black History Month, we will be spotlighting some CHS staff members to find out a little bit more about them. 
We start off this week with Mr. Whitaker. Today I have the honor of speaking with Mr. Whitaker. Um, do you want to say a little bit about yourself? Um, Mr. Whitaker, I, I teach in the English Language Arts Department. Um, I've been at uh, Columbia High School since 2002. Uh, and I'm looking forward to uh, our talk today. Since we are in Black History Month, mm -hmm. you know, um, Carter G. Woodson is the, the founder, you know, of, of Black History Month. And my concern is that not enough students know who Carter G. Woodson was or really understand his contribution of Black History Month. What Carter G. Woodson was trying to achieve with Black History Month um, was a critique of the American school system. What wasn't being taught about black Americans and the history of black Americans in the school system, um, he did that throughout the year, but Black History Month was an especially uh, important time where we would highlight you know, those achievements. People should know that um, you know, he went to Howard University, um, mm -hmm. but he had to leave Howard University because he was too black. Right? Howard University is an HBCU, so what does it mean when a person like Carter G. Woodson is too black for Howard University? Um, Carter G. Woodson got his PhD at Harvard University, but he had to switch um, dissertation advisors because his first dissertation advisor didn't think that black people had any history that was worthy of studying. That's just something you know I think is important. Um, we are in Black History Month, but I think the founder of Black History Month should really be honored and studied, you know, a little more closely. Absolutely. Thank you so much. The Shakespeare Festival Club is collecting sketches for this year's logo. That means your illustration can adorn hundreds of t-shirts, magnets, and tote bags. Just create a visual representation of CHS, Shakespeare, and the quotation. There's magic in the web of it, from Othello. All designs must be in black and white. The deadline is Wednesday. Guild Script is looking for your artwork. You can submit drawings, photos, sculptures, and more. You can drop off your work in D109 or upload it through a Google form. Just go to graphicschs.com and click on Guild Script in the navigation bar. The deadline is Friday. Those are all your announcements for this week's CHS. I'm Jamie. And I'm Gary. But before we go, we would like to congratulate our very own senior student athlete, volleyball and lacrosse player, Jamie Farden, who will represent Columbia High School at the NJSIA Annual Women in Sports Day at Seton Hall University. Congratulations, Jamie. Aww. Thanks, Gary. Remember, teachers, club advisors, team captains, if you have an announcement you want to have read on our show, make sure you email it to Mr. Camp. And remember, tomorrow is a half day, students, with a 12 p.m. dismissal. Have a great week, everyone, and make sure to tune in Monday at the top of second period for another great episode of CCN. And be sure to check out the CCN YouTube channel for more great content at Columbia Cougar News. Imagine, if you will, a place and a time where Alex James actually has a girlfriend. Alex James is like an interesting person. He's really self-obsessed and I don't really like that about him. His hair was kind of like a weird texture. I didn't really like it. Did you like him? I didn't really like him. He wasn't asking me a lot of questions about myself. Hey, welcome to the CCN room. I'm Alex. What's your name? My name is Della. Nice to meet you, Della. Are you looking to uh, start a family? I'm gonna go make out with Alex James some more. Thank yeah. you, Scott. Thank you. <laughs>